strictly meant to be a work of satirical fiction and solely for entertainment purposes. None of the information in this video has been verified by credible sources and any individual who views this should not consider these claims to be factually correct. Harassment of any individual mentioned in this video should not be. <laughs> Hello and welcome to the base of Molag 300 subscriber special. A few days ago I asked all 12 of my viewers to possibly email me some content to share in this video. Feel free to send stuff to this email right here. I don't care what it is. It could be videos, cat pics, death threats, photos of your ball bag, dessert recipes. I don't give a fuck. Today I checked my email and uh, to my surprise there was nothing. Aww. Now at first I thought this was because no one sent me anything. But upon further investigation I realized my email was hacked. That hacker deleted everything that you guys sent me. Bruh. Of course I was furious and I couldn't even understand why anyone would do this. So I continued to investigate the situation further and I was able to identify the hacker. Holy shit! That hacker was none other than a man known as... Chase Johnston. Most people watching this video right now probably have no idea who Chase Johnston is. Some of you are aware of him, or at least you think you are, because our boy Chase has been hiding some pretty serious secrets that I won't be exposing in this video. A miserable little pile of secrets! Demons are hiding in the walls, man! I've been asking Chase Johnston to subscribe to my YouTube channel for almost two years now, and he continuously refuses, time and time again, just to piss me off. Yet he still occasionally finds time to watch my content just to hit the thumbs down button and leave. What an asshole! Well, a few days ago, I finally got my wish. Chase Johnston changed his mind and decided to become my 300th subscriber for some reason. So who the fuck is Chase Johnston anyway, and why should you give a shit? We do not care. Well, Chase Johnston is a man who lives in Texas who spends much of his free time cyberbullying internet strangers. At least two people ended up killing themselves because they were completely incapable of dealing with the psychological torment that he inflicted upon them. Wow. Chase Johnston experienced zero consequences for these incidents, and he feels absolutely no remorse for the victims, or their families, or any of the lives that he has ruined. But this story is about to get a lot weirder. Can't believe I shaved my balls with a broken face last night. In 2008, Chase Johnston contacted a local criminal organization that will remain nameless for my protection. Mr. Johnston paid several members of that crime syndicate to essentially create a false identity for himself. Counterfeit documents were printed and provided to Mr. Johnston at a premium fee. He then traveled to the city of Dallas, Texas, where he became an official member of an upcoming metal band under his new alias. This band would remain active for over 10 years with Mr. Johnston as their frontman and vocalist. Little did they know that the man providing vocals for them was lying to them the whole time and using a false identity. The name of this band? Power Trip. That's right. Riley Gale and Chase Johnston what? are the same person. What the fuck? I don't mean to get political. But what the fuck is an artichoke? In November of 2019, I had the pleasure of seeing Power Trip play live at the Danforth Music Hall in Toronto. During that performance, Chase and I locked eyes in what felt like an incredibly long, awkward moment. Ew. That's when Chase realized I knew his secret. Uh-oh. And I could tell by the look on his face that he was begging for me to not expose his lies. Only nine months after that concert in Toronto, Chase Johnston faked his own death no way. under the alias Riley Gale. Was I a part of the reason he made that decision? I have no idea. And I also have no idea if the rest of the band is even aware of this situation. What I do know is that Chase Johnston will undoubtedly give this video a thumbs down, and he will definitely not share it. You, sir, have been exposed. This video was brought to you by Memes of Molag. Follow the page on Facebook for some laughs and weird shit. Link in the description of this video.
Thanks for watching.